Welcome back everybody to more Mario Sunshine. In the last episode, we started our adventure off, we got arrested. Kinda sounds familiar to Persona 5 start, but, you know, it's Mario this time, not uh, anime. Teenagers, lives about stealing hearts. It's Mario shooting goop and saving the world, I guess. I don't know if this counts as saving the world, but... You know, Mario's doing his thing. Uh, anyway, we got some more uh, black goop here, kinda... Maybe do something oil. But, you know, that's not what we're here to learn about. Oil spills, that's not a good thing. We're here to clean and kill these creatures and these little slimy things, which I don't really know what they are, but, you know. We're just here to have a good time and help everyone out, is honestly what we're doing. Oh my god, he's back. If you hold down R until it clicks, you will stand still while. I don't care. I'm kind of just doing my own thing. I know what I'm doing, but I don't appreciate the sass. So, thank you very much. Goodbye. And we're going to unlock a new world here. Uh, this is Rico Harbor. I don't really see a point in going in yet, but, you know, we'll get to it one day. I don't think we have to go in there to accomplish anything, but... The main thing I want to do real quick is get a couple more blue coins before we get into, uh... Not get into, get back into Delfino Plaza, and by Delfino Plaza I mean Bianco Hills. Because that was the world we started last episode, we got a couple blue coins there. We got our first star by killing that, uh, like, mud-looking goop guy, and, you know, we had fun there. Couldn't hurt to go back and hand it even more fun. I can't find this blue coin. I think it's right here, but... Yeah! Look at that. Uh, so yeah. There's a lot of these dumb pipes that require you to get blue coins from, and... I think I know where they all are, but... I say I think a lot of things, and a lot of the time I don't actually know what I'm doing. So, you know, don't judge me if I'm... Doing stuff wrong. Let me live. Let me do my own thing, and we can all have fun in the process. We are currently two and a half minutes into this episode, and we've accomplished a lot, so get off my back. We haven't really accomplished anything. Uh, we got a blue coin. Maybe that's about it. I don't know why I went this way, because I don't think that's what I was supposed to do, and by that, I mean that actually is what I was supposed to do. So get off my back. I know what I'm doing. I'm sorry for yelling at you guys. I'm just trying my best. I just want you guys to appreciate this hard work and labor that I'm putting in. I'm just... I want to be a good guide and a good best YouTuber I possibly can be, and I just... I don't know what just happened there. I should have been shot up, but I didn't. But yeah. It happens. Alright, uh... What do we got here? We got a woman! Hello! You want to work for me a little bit? I'd love for you to bring me... I'm craving some bananas! Bring me three, would you? Just bring the fruit here and put it in this basket, okay? I would love to, but like... <laughs> That's stealing. Like, there's legit a fruit market right here. People are trying to live their lives, and I'm just coming out here, stealing your nanners, and giving them to this woman for free. I don't think that's allowed, but, you know what? I'm not complaining. We're going to do it anyway, because we probably got a good reward. All right, you just saw me grab one and put it in. There's no point in showing the other two, so I'll be back. The mission has been a complete success, delivering the final nanner. Look at that. Alright, what do you got? Thanks, sweetums. A blue coin, of course. Alright, I think that's enough blue coinage for now. We'll return to it sometime in the near future. But right now, I just wanna... I kinda wanna play some levels. We're probably just gonna end up <laughs> getting more blue coins here, but... You know, a nice change of scenery is what we can really go for. What we got? Down with Petey Piranha, my boy. Petey. What a good guy. Not really a good guy, he's kinda rude, but... We're gonna hang out with him anyway. And he's got a star, so like... What else could you ask for? Anyway, how's everyone doing today? I'm doing alright. I'm kind of recording this back-to-back -back with the other episodes, so I'm kind of doing the same I was doing then, so if I still get that nice hypergenic energy that I know I'm lacking. But, you know, I'm trying. I'm working on it. I will say... Making these videos has definitely increased my ability of speaking, I feel like. It definitely helps with the process of going on longer with talking and just good stuff like that. Like, 
I recently, in my, I have a business class at school, and we have to do, like, speeches and crap. I feel like doing stuff like this has definitely helped with, like, the thought of, like, just talking off the top of my head, because we, <coughs> with that speech, we had nothing to work with. It was just all off our memory and, like, what we, it was on a hobby of ours, so I was just, I'd ramble on. I didn't really want to copy anyone, so I just, like, thought of tried to go with something that no one really said, so I did the topic of fantasy football, which I enjoy. I don't know if you guys do as much. I think it's a fun part of watching football every year, but that's just me. Uh, that blue coin's not there, and now I feel stupid. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Like, doing stuff like this and just being able to talk off the top of my head, I feel like it's definitely helped with stuff like that, where, like, more so before, I, I kind of be... I mean, I was still nervous doing it because, you know, like, most of those people in that class that aren't like, no, I don't really know any of you, but, <laughs> you know, it's like, you're not watching me when I'm doing this, it's kind of like this whole stage fright thing, but I got through it and it went fine, but, you know, roll the story is, stuff like this helps, and if you're, like, thinking to yourself, like, I don't think I'd be able to do this, like, talking-wise, being able to interact, like, I didn't think so either, and I actually... I think I'm doing a decent job at this. I'm definitely nowhere near. I'm about to get clocked by that thing, aren't I? Oh my god, I'm about to run out of water, too. I can't rely on flood. Oh god. Can I even traverse through here? This is kind of awful. Well, thankfully, there's water right here. Look at that. But yeah, if you like, if you're stressing, you're trying to start off, like, I didn't think I'd be that good at this at first. Like I said, I didn't, still don't think I'm that great, but I'm trying more and more, and I definitely think I'm improving each and each video. I hope I am, at least. <laughs> but it's definitely fun, worth your time, if you want to give it a shot. It's never too late. YouTube might be falling apart as we speak with all these new interesting rules and stuff they're doing, but... You know, I'm sure something might emerge along the way. That'll be the next top thing. Like, the circle of life always, you know, something new and interesting comes along and brings fun new opportunities for you. So, definitely give it a shot if you want. Anyway, we're about to fight Petey Piranha. I wonder if we can sneak atop of him and just steal that star. Nope, there's no way. That's kind of a shame. Anyway, hey, buddy. He just gave me a nice thumbnail, so I'm very appreciative of that. I wish I had the ability to scream so loudly that the ground beneath me fell. Like, I get that they're on a sturdy root, like a unsturdy roof, but, you know. Uh, yeah, I don't know what I'm trying to say. But, a loud, like, sword in the like, pee from this guy. Anyway, we got a first. This is technically a first boss, actually, because... Technically, those goop monsters. What just happened? Why did that happen? That was kind of dumb. Uh, I'm gonna spray in his mouth. Got some objective here, and then his belly button gets all big, and we gotta stomp on him to kill him. Nice. And just gotta rinse and repeat the process a few more times. Kind of typical Mario stuff. Three hits, take the guy out. That's all you really gotta do ever. It's, you know, we try our best, and that's all that truly matters. Alright, bounce on his belly one more time. Is it he or she? I don't know. I should just say it so I don't, you know, misinterpret. That's never a good thing to do. Oh my god, I almost got clocked into next year. That could have been bad. Still a little. Yeah, I don't want those guys to bother. Not. We got there in time. Look at that. Too good at this game. And kill him. What? What? Okay, there we go. <laughs> that was kind of interesting. But, you know, we got it done. And he's dead. Good work, team. And by team, I mean, well, me. Well, I guess Flood's helping out. Mario's not really doing a whole lot. Flood's, you know, the key team piece here. I think Mario's doing like the butt stomps and stuff, but Flood, Flood's packing the heat. You already know he's got that. He's, I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> uh, just save and continue and get over this. I don't, I'm just making a complete fool of myself. I kind of got a pee too. I've been drinking a lot of water in the process of doing this. Because, you know, staying hydrated is 
key to survival and you know surviving's the main point of life other than like other stuff but survival that's what life's about anyway i say we take a break from bianco hills real quick and go do a delfino plaza shine because if you may have noticed when we were grabbing the uh, shine over there on the last episode there's a pipe over here that we can enter it'll lead us to some fun stuff i didn't mean to pause it's on me yeah, yeah, I know the cuts are unprofessional, but I'm getting interrupted, so I'm sorry. But, uh, anyway, I forgot what I was talking about, but we're going into a pipe. That's always exciting. Welcome to the easiest level in all of video games, which now that I said that, I'm probably going to die, because all you have to do is go down the slide, and honestly, there's not really anything much to it. Just a big slide. Honestly, you could just jump like that and skip the whole thing, but, you know, it comes with a bit of a gamble, but... Look at that. I already got the shine. Can you believe it? We're five shines in out of... 120? I think? I don't think they switched it. I think it stays at a solid 120. So that's exciting, at least. Oh, look at that. We already got another pile of oil to stop. And it still doesn't really look like it's getting any more bright here. That's kind of sad. But it's like... It's not even cloudy. It's just... Sad. I guess it looks a little more sunny, maybe. I don't know. Anyway, let's just. I don't. I'm stuck. Scoop's not going away. <laughs> I need help. I need an adult. I think Mario is an adult. Not I think Mario is an adult. The man's got a freaking mustache. That just instantly signifies adulthood. That took way too long when I was. Honestly, starting to get a little worried that something's up. Because, like, you can't tell me that's a normal occurrence to not have the Goop Monster open his mouth. I just screwed up. Unprofessional. I'm standing kind of far away, though, so that's kind of. Kind of got to shoot at a longer pace. Man, <laughs> these little colorful things are. Oh my god, he just shot out so many. But that has not stopped me before. It will not stop me now, and I will win this battle, as I always do. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Wow. I missed. Because that stupid guy jumped on me. Unbelievable, but we still got the job done. That's all we're trying. Oh, another world's unlocked. How exciting. And also, we're not going into this one either. <laughs> That's not funny. I don't know why I'm laughing. That wasn't even a joke in the slightest. Unfunny Kyle strikes again. But, uh... Yeah. I say we go back into Bianco Hills. See what they got for us next. Probably some exciting stuff. This mission coming up is actually a really fun one. And it is called the Hillside Cave Secret. And, you know, if you ever see a secret in the title, um... You honestly can really almost always assure that... It's actually gonna be a really good level. Ah, oh, we got some jumpy boys around. Also, there may or may not be new blue coins this time around. I honestly couldn't tell you whether or not there are, because I don't remember, but we're gonna hope there are. I know there is one that might have spawned by now. It would be over on that hill there. And <laughs> if you remember a few minutes ago, I wasted my time talking about my speech and jumping up top there to potentially find one. It is over there. Alright, so we're going to take a few moments to go over there and get that because blue coins are essential to beating this game. They net you every 10 blue coins uh, if you take to the raccoon people. <laughs> yes, you heard me right. The raccoon people. If you take that to their home in uh where we stopped that oil monster where I told you Rico Harbor is, every 10 blue coins you give them, you get a star. So, we're being yelled at about how the shine sprites are missing. Those raccoons are hoarding 24 stars. And there's, like, those missions in Delfino Plaza. Like, they have a good amount of stars already by themselves and they're yelling at me saying that I ruined their lives and that I need to go to jail and clean up their island. Like, this is just awful. 
You don't treat a man like this. Mario is a good man. There's a blue coin somewhere. It hasn't spawned yet. But believe me, at one point in life, there is a blue coin there. Speaking of blue coins, there's one right here. There's also other ones in the lake, but I don't really feel like getting this right now. But we'll grab this one real quick, just because it's right here. So that'll net us number 23, like Michael Jordan or LeBron James, whatever way you want to look at it. But yeah, it's 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 good times. Also, you jump really high if you jump on those things. And, you know, getting high up in the air like that, I guess could be fun to some people. It's kind of fun to me, but, you know, it just all depends on who you are. Alright, so as you can see there, our flood is being taken away from us, and that is the gimmick of this level. These secret levels, is you don't have your flood, and honestly, it just makes these levels so much more fun. This could have been... This game is honestly still so good. And if they hit... <laughs> oh, well, that's what it's like to die. But if they had more like this, it would make this game so much better. I mean, I feel like it's a good balance where there's a good amount of these where you don't have flood. And I mean, technically, you don't have to use flood. I've seen many playthroughs of people who do the floodless runs or hover nozzle-less floods runs. Because you need flood to beat the game because you can't beat those, uh, what do you call it, goop monsters without them. And yeah, but the hover nozzle challenge, hover nozzle-less challenge, if that's how you word it. No flood hover nozzle challenge. I don't know, but I've seen it done, and it's just, it looks way too complicated for a man like me, but, I mean, you know, I'm sure if I try hard enough, maybe I could accomplish the impossible and do such a thing, but I just don't have the patience to do something like that. Maybe one day, though. Alright. These two are just like, I'm, I'm fighting for my life here. I'm like R. Kelly, fighting for my damn life, and you're just sitting here watching. Unbelievable. It's like Robert De Niro. You're laughing. All this stuff's happening, and you're just sitting here laughing, but you're not laughing, you're watching. <sighs> anyway, let's take a break. We got another fruit lady. This time she wants some pineapples. Because, you know, I'm a nerd and no stuff like that. I've just been playing this game non-stop. It's been a good year since I played this game, so I take breaks every now and then. Actually, before we do that, this guy should give us a few coins, too. I don't know how he caught on fire, but <laughs> you know, it happens. So I'm not gonna judge him. I'm just gonna put him out and be a good resident. You know, technically, these people are treating me horrible, and I don't have to do this. I can just let this man burn. Please, let me talk to you. Please. There we go. Give me my blue coin. That was actually kind of risky, because that blue coin might have uh, <laughs> glitched into that tree if I wasn't careful. Because yes, that is something that frequently can happen in this game. And it's kind of annoying. Alright, um, this is kind of annoying to do too, because it's like, you gotta show that ball is life. I forgot, we got that 24 coins. We gotta channel our inner Kobe. Rest in peace, Kobe. That's honestly really sad, and... I don't know. It's still a big shock to me that he's gone. And it's just still honestly so crazy. Like, I don't believe it. But anyway, channel our inner. We're letting Kobe down. This is awful. All right, you know what? Perfect prime zone. Show him who's boss. I will get this. This is one of those irritating blue coins that people normally save for later. But we just want to knock it out of the way now. Wow. Wow. If I don't get this in the next 30 seconds, then this is definitely getting cut out. <laughs> Come on. There's definitely an easier way to do this, but it's honestly more fun doing it like this. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Shoot that. Wow, that was a brick, if I've ever seen one. I will get this. I don't care if this takes all video. We are 19 and a half minutes in. I gotta wrap this ish up soon. Why is it not going far at all? It was going s No, I don't. Hush! Stop talking to me. No, please! Stop! Can I... There we go. Okay. 
How about if I just stand here? Jump, shoot. Okay, still too far away. Jump shot. Show him who's boss, Mario. Wow. Why was that so easy? <laughs> this time, it's the real honor. We're gonna throw it up and yell Kobe. And that's how it's done. <sighs> Alright. Let's get our blue coin. Alright, so that'll take us to six shines and 25 blue coins. I think this is a decent enough spot to end things off at. Um, next episode, we'll continue Bianco Hills and just live life as we be. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.